So some of our models come with digital mirror as an option. Um, here are some of the features that digital mirror provides. Uh, first thing, you'll want to adjust the mirror without the digital part turned on so that you can see it and use it just as a regular, you would a regular mirror. Um, when you're ready, um, all you do is flip the bottom portion and it will bring the camera alive in the back so that you don't have to look through the headrests and other obstructions, like maybe you have too many people back there. Um, up here in the top right corner, this is just an indicator telling you that the camera is on and functioning. Uh, the first set of buttons here are for our home link system uh, for your garage doors. Uh, with digital mirror, it actually does have the instructions. Just simply pressing one of the garage door buttons will bring open that and you can hit the continue and it will walk you right through how to pair your garage doors. Now also on the opposite side are the buttons for the menu for digital mirror. There are many settings that you can adjust. The first button here will open those settings. There is the brightness for the digital mirror. You have two other buttons that you'll toggle through to adjust these settings. The next one would be the angle of the camera. The next one will be left and right. And then also a tilt of the camera. The next one would be a search for um, instructions. Then you also have the auto dimming feature is what this is. You can turn it on and off with these buttons here. And then cycling through, um, you will go to the home link instructions and then the last one is the language and if you don't want the digital mirror you can just flip it right back and you've got your standard mirror back for you any other questions you guys have please go ahead and email us or call us here at the Lexus technology department here at performance Lexus